least that leaves most of my terrible hair out. Hi hey guys, this is me, Boo. And Dad. And, and today, we're going to be reviewing Marvel's Mysterio and Spider-Man from the Molten Man Build-A-Figure. Right. Yes, we have the complete set, so this is going to be part one. Um, of the Multiman Build of Figure series, so we're going to unbox these, give you our thoughts on them, and then of course stay tuned for the uh, rest of the series, because we're going to have to go to, um, let's see, it looks like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven figures to get we, to Molten Man. But we are missing Spider-Man. Um, how'd that happen, dude? I don't know, we couldn't find it. Oh, but you said he's not required to build Molten Man? Mm -mm. See, if he doesn't uh, have a number. Oh, okay. I thought I bought you him already. Don't we have a piece? No, um, that was a different Spider-Man. Oh, okay, gotcha. All right. So, anyway, yeah, so we'll get started here. You want to start with Big? Uh, so I'm a stereo. Okay, so we'll slide. Here's the friend of the box. Spider-Man over here for a second. Yeah, said in the back, the chip gives you everyone that you need to build a uh, multi man. You need Spider-Man. Well, not really necessary. Okay, so Spider-Man does not come with a figure. He's just in. I mean, come with a multi man piece. Yeah, he's just in the line. So we have um, Mysterio, Spider-Man. Here's this one. Hydro Man. Uh, Hydro Man. Um, <laughs> Super Evil Spider Man. He's actually called Doppelganger Spider Man. Doppelganger Spider Man, Spider Woman, and Marvel's um, Scorpion. Right. So yeah, not a, not a bad series of figures in this one. I don't think. We'll pop this up a little bit. And this one might be our favorite. We really wanted this one for a while. Yeah, we were really excited about getting Mysterio. We don't have him, or I don't think we have any of these in our collection yet. Mm -mm. So yeah, we were we were happy they come out with Mysterio in this one, um, especially in, in a totally awesome little figure like Molten Man. Okay, Marvel's Mysterio. Give it to us, boo. The Master Illinois Mysterio battles his. Both Spider-Man using his wits and the technology embedded in his suit. Right. So yeah, everybody's probably really familiar with it. Yes. With a uh, with yeah. Excuse the haircut. <laughs> Due to quarantine, we haven't been able to get one lately, yeah. so things are looking a little shaggy. Com comment, <laughs> comment down comment down below how you have you um how have you survived? <laughs> right. Yes. Is any, anybody else been able to get a haircut? <laughs> But, um, but yeah, we're excited about getting Mysterio. Everybody's probably real familiar with him from because he's in the, the most current Spider-Man movie, the, the part two um, Spider-Man. And, of course, he plays the main, he's the main villain in that one. Um, well, he kind of has, like, he creates, like, these virtual, war, uh, uh, virtual worlds or scenes. And then um, acts like he's saving the day, but he's really not. He's just trying to, uh, he's just trying the most popular uh, superhero by causing all this destruction and uh, Spider-Man has to figure all that out which is which is pretty cool I, I like that movie that was, that was not bad at all yeah this one really in there yes he is there you go got it alright so even is though out. I destroyed the box here comes Mysterio this is back piece yep I got a nice little Spider-Man logo back there wow Okay, here he is with his front plastic. Let's take him off. Oh, yeah, take him off. Now we can touch him and stuff. Alright, now we're looking for a motion man. Alright, so here is going to be our piece, and it looks like this is going to be a lower uh, leg for Molten um, Man. No, that's actually pretty much his leg. Okay, so that <laughs> is his leg. leg. Alright. Well, actually, he has he has one um, short and fat leg, and he has one tall and skinny leg. Oh, okay. Alright, so yeah, once we get all the pieces out, we'll definitely get a good review over, over Molten Man, for sure. So that's it for him, on him for now. Okay, now let's get on to the accessories. Yes. Mysterio. Alright, he comes with two, looks like interchangeable fists for maximum Spider Man chicken buffet. It would and actually it be comes. kind of weird to have a superhero fight a superhero. <laughs> yes, so that's what happened in the movie. So we found out Molten, and then we found out that Mysterio 
was not what he seemed. Yeah, it turned evil. Yes. His head popped off. Oh, no! But right, we're going to hope that comes to put it back on. Yeah, it looks like it's going to snap back on. You see, there's his head. <laughs> A very round, sparkly glow. Okay. The, All right, there's just rustled them out of the package here. Now let's pop his head back on. Right, so we get the head back on. Probably we should put the cape on first. Oh, yes. I know how, um, okay. We oh. know how to do these. We'll be, we build a couple of ba uh, build a figures, so we should know how to pop heads on. Right, some of them are just a little tough to get back on there. Okay, well, so I'm going to add these to the table. Mm. Nope, still not on. Alright, let me dead, give it a go here. Dead strength. Right, you can see it's just got the little, the little ball hinge there. And he will pop back on here as long as I can get him lined up the right way with a little maximum pressure right boo yeah okay i felt like that got it um does it matter i don't know which one is front and back they look kind of the same um i think i think that's it okay let's show them off wait a minute where's the picture um Let's see here. It doesn't really tell us a whole lot there. I think it's either way. They look the same on both sides. Okay. See? Alright. He's got a big crystal ball at the head. And here is Mysterio. Well, actually, there was, there was actually one Mysterio where I could take his helmet off, and there's actually like a whole head under it. Oh no, that would have been really cool. Yeah, you don't get that with this one. You just get the domed head. Um, but still, overall, I think he's a really cool looking character. Yeah. They did a pretty good job with the details on his costume. He's got a lot of green and gold going on in this one. Um, there's a good look at the cape. Got some nice uh, designs down the back side of his cape. Uh, you can see the his head here, um, his uh, crystal ball head, whatever it is. It's, uh, it's pretty much the same all the way around, so I don't think it really matters which way you put it on. Um, it's just kind of got some sparkly, glittery looking stuff in there. But yeah, he's, he's cool. And of course he comes with these hands here, which are kind of like grabby hands that you can change out into kick butt fisty hands, depending on uh, whatever his mission is for the day. Any thoughts on him, Boog? He's really cool. Boog really likes Mysterio? Yeah, he is awesome. Wait, this is the one I want to keep there. Oh, are you going to put on the punchy hands? I'll put one on. Oh, okay. Nice. Now he's ready for some punch in action. Spider-Man, where are you? Come face me now. Oh, <laughs> uh, kind of. <laughs> kind of what pose he's in. All right. Anything else to say about Mysterio? No. Nope. All right. So let's get on now Your to problem, his head. Probably will never be Spider-Man. Right no. Now this is like undercover Spider-Man. I think this was from the uh, same movie as uh, Mysterio was in, The Far from home um yes because they both have it on the logo they're both from the far from home movie and this is when spider-man um pretty much has to use his kind of like stealth suit uh which is also a really cool figure to have and as you can see right here it comes with a giant totally huge i'm thinking um molten man arm so let's get into him boo oh do you want to read the synopsis on the back oh yeah Spider-Man. Peter Parker gears up to upgrade his suit to take on new challenges and new enemies. Whoa! Yes, he's ready to upgrade the suit. <clears throat> to all black, which is kind of boring. <laughs> <laughs> You're no longer Spider-Man, Spider-Man. <laughs> well, it's better than his regular pajama suit. <laughs> it's not pajamas. 
Well, actually, I yeah, Tony Stark helps him a whole, out a whole lot in the in the suit department for sure. Well, actually, Iron Spider, I think, was the coolest. Iron Spider was your was the, your favorite. Yeah. Uh, okay, there he is. As you can see, uh -oh. Molten Man's arm is like almost twice the size of the actual wow. Spider Man figure. That is a big arm. Bulk. All right, yeah, let's go over this right quick first. I can show it to you. You can see the size. This is. Huge. Um, yeah, this is just a big, big arm. So, Molten Man, obviously he's not proportional. This is his larger arm. Uh, the other side is going to be a little bit smaller. But, as far as build a figures go, this is the biggest uh, arm we have ever received up to this point. Right, babe? Yeah. And I'm really loving the detail that they did on Molten Man. I'm thinking that they've done a great job. I don't know if, uh, if they've done... Um, Molten Man before or not, but if they have, let us know. I would like to look them up and see the differences. But this is super cool. What is that? It's like a little thing that goes in his arm. Oh, like a piece of steel that sticks out or something? Oh, that would be cool. So, well, we'll get we'll get that all checked out when we do the um. Yeah, we'll figure that out once we actually build him. We still got several more figures to go. <laughs> yeah, and this is only the first episode. All right, Big, tell us what you think about Spider Man there. He's really cool. Let's get out of his accessories. Okay, this, and this Spider-Man actually did come with... <coughs> this Spider-Man did come with interchangeable heads. Oh, nice. So we got a couple of little accessories of Spider-Man, plus the giant arm. And two interchangeable heads. Yeah. Of course. Yeah, this is a really good series. I'm excited about this one. Yes. We don't have, we didn't have any Spider-Man uh, uh, characters, did we at all? Well, um, we did, we do have Mark Three. Mark Three, that's the one I got you, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That was before I, I knew we were going to be doing the. Uh, the um, What's the yeah, other one? Don't spoil oh, it. sorry. Okay, I can't tell about the next one. Because it's top secret. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so who do we have let's here? Let's show off the accessories. Oh, sorry, yes. All right, so let's show off kind of like undercover Spider-Man, and you get an interchangeable head here where his goggles are kind of lifted, uh, and you can see his eyes, which is a nice accessory to have. And you also get out, uh, get two interchangeable hands. So he comes wearing fist hands, but then you can change them out to these spidey hands. Well, spider shooting uh, yes, hands. Yes, spider shooting hands, ready for the web sling. <clears throat> All right. Next up, Spider Man. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, wrong signal. Spider Man. Spider Man. Can do whatever a spider, spider can. can. Right. And here he is, undercover. Uh, or I like to call him Stealth Spidey-Man. A lot of black on this figure, folks. A lot of black. Um, <laughs> let's see. Can I hold him up for a second? But the details are good. It does look just, uh, again, very, very, very similar to uh, the costume he was wearing in the movies. Um, which I think they did a great job size-wise. You know, he's about the size Peter Parker would be. Um, not, not a huge hulking guy by any stretch of the imagination. <laughs> <laughs> right, Peter Parker's kind of a little dude, right? Yeah. But kicks major butt. Yeah. Trying to get him close enough there to. I gotta fix this lighting for our next one. It's a little too dark in here. Um. But anyway, there's. I uh, hope you can see some of his details. He's got a little belt on here that goes around. And uh, like I said, the cell suit's very cool. Kind of reminds me a lot of uh, Black Widow's um, suit she wears most of the time. So yeah, I think this is a great little figure. Not bad at all. All right, Big, what do you think? Well, it's interchange to the head. Okay, Big's going to swap out the head and uh, change it out for the ones where the, the visors are popped up so you can actually see his eyes. Yeah, I'm going to give this to you because you need to be careful. These might break off. Oh, yeah, we don't, we don't want any breakage, right? Yeah, they might break off. Yeah, it can be a little challenging sometimes to get them snapped in just right because you have to hold that piece in place and then get the little ball joint to line up. I think twisting helps. Alright, I think we got it. 
Okay, so that's what he looks like with the headpiece on. There it is. But then, which one do you like more? Uh, which headpiece? Yeah. I like the one where you can see his eyes. I, I don't know. I just I just think that's kind of cool. Well, we do want battle action. Okay, so who's going back to the one where you cannot see his eyes? Yeah. All right. He's off. Okay, I get this. You going with the back on? Okay. You might be broken a little more since he's been on there. Okay. Are you getting him going there? Going to. All right. Oh, here, let me give it a go. We're getting a little long on the video. We're already over 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's snap in. Just kind of pops a little bit. There yeah. it is. All right, boot nailed it. Okay, so I do also like that it does have um, butterfly joints. Oh, that he comes with the butterfly joints. I forgot about that feature. Good point, boot. So he can really do some um, st stretches now. <laughs> right. Okay. Boot's gonna change out the hands. Because these spidey hands are way cooler than this. Yes, definitely. Okay. That way he's ready for some web slinging action. Okay. There we go. Alright, let's show what that looks like. I'm going to bring them all the way in with the butterfly joint. Okay, let's Check hold it down a little closer so they can see good. Oops. Nice. Look how awesome that is. Yeah, very, very cool. Alright guys, that's going to wrap it up here for Mysterio and Spider-Man Spider -Man in stealth mode. We will see you on the next one. Just uh, stay tuned for part two here. And once we get all these figures reviewed, we will build Molten Man. Bye-bye, everybody. Hey guys, make sure you subscribe to Boog and Dad TV for some more awesome toy fun. Bye. Bye. See you in the next one.